up? It's War Chief, and today we're going to talk about getting ideas using machine, and it is awesome, and I feel like it's the best way to get ideas if you're stuck in a creative flow and you just need inspiration or something like that. But I'm going to show you right now, so let's get into it. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, comment down below. Yep, everything. Yep, go. All right, what up? It's your boy. <laughs> That's like standard YouTube stuff right there. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we got a machine right here. And, you know, favorite doll, bit, wig, what, homie. And uh, I already wrote a couple of things. And I just, like, didn't want to, like, sit here and write stuff and spend, like, 20 minutes of your time trying to make something cool. But I, actually, this took me, like, five minutes. All I did was use the uh, keyboard mode. And I used a certain minor scale to make this. I'll play it for you. Really easy. Just I just dabbled a little bit. It took me like two minutes to make that with the scale mode and machine. And then I made these pads. I used the chord mode for in machine to make this. You get the idea. We'll hear it later. And then okay, this is I made that in like five minutes in using the chord mode and then the keyboard mode and I picked a scale a random scale because I'm just trying to get ideas I'm not trying to create a whole song I'm just getting ideas to create a song and the best way to do this is in machine because this is the best sketch pad ever to create songs so this is pretty much my four bar loop eight bar loop that I'm going to turn into a song and it's really fast but the best thing about this is like when I do drums say uh I got something going on right here I'll play these drums um with everything I made and it sounds pretty cool I'll just play it but it doesn't end there say you want to pick different drums like everybody has their own style let's pick a random kit Amsterdam all right all it is is a kick four on the <laughs> four on the floor you know what I mean? But anyways, but the BPM, you can tell right here, is um, not going to be 75. You're going to, but like, it's a house track. So you're going to want the BPM to be like 125, 120, 128, something around there. It's real slow, like, t -t. so let's go up to the BPM and let's put that up to 128. And, see, and it just, you just, just sounds good still everything I made so let's listen to it it's it's crazy let's pick a different drum kit and it, it just gives you a whole different feel you can have a house track a hip-hop track and if you make a certain genre like that shouldn't limit you you should make everything because you should just love music <laughs> you know what i mean like just but make what you want i'm not telling you to change your style but if you get bored with your style you should make something else try it out you know but it's not you're never wrong making different styles you know what i mean this is a slower one it but this one says it's at 86 bpm and all you have to do is it's pretty much trial and error the whole time so 86 and then we'll see what it sounds like doesn't sound that great let's go to 75 bpm i would change up the hi-hats but that's all you have to do like say you don't like these hi-hats right here and you're like yeah i'm not i'm not feeling jesus how long is that bar let's put it down to four bars right here and then let's delete that and i'll press play and then i'll just record what I think will fit the beat, so let's get to it. And that's simple, I just changed up the drum beat like on the fly, made it my own. It's like people might say, oh you're cheating, you're just using drum loops. Like. Yeah, I'm pretty much using drum loops, but I'm making it my own dog. That's just, this is the best way to get ideas is in machine because you can literally, like this pad mode right here, I made this in like two minutes. 
and then you can you can change it up say you don't like that sequence and we want you want to change it say like uh let's get a new pattern four bars give me like five seconds press into it real fast let it let the thing set in it's on a minor scale and then we'll just get right into it you gotta feel it though Need some work, but you know what I mean. CCC, you know what I mean. You just gotta, it's just trial and error, and you just gotta try it. And I feel like machine is the best way to get your ideas out there, especially if you don't know music theory. If you don't know music theory at all, machine will help you a bunch. It will increase your production like all just through the roof if you understand how to use the key mode, the keyboard mode, and the chords. Yeah, scales and chords mode. But anyways, yeah, that was the video today. I hope you enjoyed it. It's just about getting fast ideas on machine. And yeah, thanks for watching the video. If you liked the video, give me a like, uh, comment down below. Tell me what you think. If you use a machine or you think about getting a machine, this uh, machine micro I got uh, last year. I think I got it for like Christmas or something. It was only 250 or 230 something like that. It's real cheap. You get the software. It just is so good for making music. And I thank you guys everyone should have a machine should be like oprah you get a machine you get a machine you get a machine everyone should get a machine micro it is the best thing i think and it's fun to just play the beats play the pads it's just it just helps you inspires you it is like dope but anyways yeah make sure to subscribe like the video and i will catch you guys next time thank you so much bye